Hey, do you want to have some really cool camera effects while you stream? Well, you've come to the right place. Today I'll be showing you how to use Snap Camera, which is basically a desktop version of the camera functions of the Snapchat app on your phone. There's a heap of filters to choose from, so it's something to keep your stream fresh and fun. Here's how we set it up. First, we'll need to download Snap Camera. You can get this from snapcamera.snapchat.com. There's a link in the description. Click Download. Now click I have read the privacy policy box and click download for PC. Once downloaded, run the EXE and go through the installation process. It's pretty self-explanatory, but feel free to follow along. Once installed, the software will open. Click next, then click finish to start using it. If you see this screen, that likely means your camera is being used by other software on your computer, such as OBS. You'll need to close this other software, then restart Snap Camera. To restart it, you'll need to click the up arrow down the bottom right of your taskbar, right click on the Snap Camera icon, and then click Quit. Now open it back up again, and you should see your camera feed. Below your camera feed, you'll see a list of effects. Simply click on them to activate, and then click on them again to deactivate. Once you've found a filter you like, you can click the star icon to save it as a favorite. Favorites can be accessed by clicking the star at the top left of the software. There are heaps of lenses made by the community, so have a look around and see what looks cool to you. So how do you use this in OBS? When you open OBS, you'll notice that your camera source is blank, as Snapcam is currently using it. Simply create a new video capture device source or edit your existing one by right clicking and going to properties. Make the device Snap Camera. And that's it. Now when you activate an effect in the Snap Camera software, you'll see it in OBS. If you don't want to open the Snap Camera software every time you want to activate a filter, it's easy to set up some hotkeys. You can set up individual hotkeys for each of the lenses you have in your favorites. You can do this by accessing your favorites and then clicking the keyboard icon. You can then click on the Add Hotkey button for the filter you want to add one for, and then press the combination of keys you'd like to use to activate it, and then click Save. Now simply press the key combination to activate and deactivate the filter. For those who have a Stream Deck, you can then create a hotkey action and have it be the same key combination you just set up. Well now you know how to use some cool camera filters on your stream. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below, and if you're interested in my stream setup, I stream over at twitch.tv slash 62 There's a link in the description. See you next time.